I am bringing this to you late as usual, but it's actually not even my fault because Walmart Beauty box, which is a $5 a quarter box, I think you're just paying for shipping and the samples are free. I really don't know. You pay $5 and you can fill out your little profile. I, actually, I don't even know. Don't listen to me. Just go to the website. I'll link it down below. Um, I know they have two different options. Somebody had commented asking about a natural box option, which I did not see when I logged in. So no clue if that's legit or not. Um, I do know there is a trendsetter and a classic option. The trendsetter is geared towards ages 35 and under, and the classic is 35 and older. I currently choose to get both boxes, so I'm spending $10 a quarter. Now these are the fall boxes, which I did not receive until November, and that is also when I'm filming this. So that's kind of late compared to normal. So, um, not sure what's going on. I'm, you know, I say this about other boxes, but I am honestly really tempted to quit this one. I know it's $5 a quarter, which is $20 a year times two, which is $40, which in the scheme of things, you know, it's really not that much. It's like, you know, a frou-frou coffee a quarter. So, um, but I, I'm kind of getting overdone on samples because most of this is all sampler stuff. So, Info's down below. Let's just go through this. I'm going to show you the ones that I received for the Classic and the Trendsetter, and then I'm also going to show you for comparison a Target Beauty Box, which is not available for subscription, but I'll tell you about that when I get to it. So let's just dive into it. I'm going to skip all the normal chitter chatter today because this usually will go long enough. Um, so here's the two boxes. They look the same, so you need to track your tracking um, or just have a clue which is which. Um, like on mine, I have like my classic, I just have worked my address a certain way and then on my trendsetter one, I tweaked it a little bit so they're, I mean, obviously I still get them, but just like how I put in my name. So I know that way so I don't have to deal with the tracking. So this is the one that just arrived today and it is the trendsetter one which I'm gonna show you and I'm a little disappointed because the trendsetter is usually your younger box which has usually a fun makeup item or just something fun a hair accessory something well this is not <laughs> very fun and it's not very full but compared to other other times we've had it um, I don't have them, my Walmart, like in its own playlist. I'll link in my playlist just for my unboxings and you can search there for Walmart if you want to see previous months. Um, not a big deal if you do or you don't. Just if you're interested to see if you've never received it, the type of things you can get. So I'm just pulling everything out. There are some inserts here this month. This is the little insert specific to the box focus your beauty and it wants you to rate and review the fall products it doesn't say on here one time they showed if it was trendsetter trend trendsetter or classic this one does not so um, they do say to visit beautybox.walmart.com to complete your profile for more personalized boxes including skin type hairstyle beauty style and hair type so does that mean they're going to try and make them more custom? Because from what I've seen so far, these we all just received the same things. And that's how it goes. <laughs> so maybe they're going to try and they want you to fill it out so you can get a better one. Uh, these are usually tied, I'm sure, to the products I'm going to show you. So this is a company I've never heard of. It's called Found. It's just an informational type insert. Here is a Jurgens informational. Sometimes there's coupons on these. So far, we're not batting very good with that. Um, Hask information and uh, oh, this one is actually a coupon, and I don't know that it has anything. It's just a coupon. I'm sorry. This way is this horizontal, but this is vertical. We are now looking at old lady box for Kathy. So yes, Kathy would need her gray hairs covered up, which she's doing tomorrow but well tomorrow is just a trim I don't every eight weeks I get the the drays the drays the grays covered okay so there is a very small sample from Olay tone perfecting cream there is a coupon in the back which is three dollars off 
and it does not expire until June 30th of next year, so that's good. Sometimes you'll get like expired coupons, which annoys me a lot. Um, not this time. This is for that Haas. This is, you know, for a foil packet, this is a very decent sized sample. It is a deep conditioning mask. Here is that company I had not heard of before found. It is a pore care charcoal, charcoal sheet mask. Now this is a little different to me, but that could just be me. I don't have like pore issue, but it's like purifies pores, absorbs excess oil, which I typically associate more with younger skin, but I really don't know how much they try and tie this to age. So these we have had again and again and again in boxes, specifically Walmart boxes. I think they're here every month. Jergens, you have a very nice array of products. Enough with the wet skin moisturizers. I think most of us have figured it out. It's just lotion with a higher price tag. My opinion, I'm a little sassy today, so I will apologize if I come off rude. I don't mean to be, but um, I don't use these. I give them to a friend, but you can just use them like regular lotion. I do not like to mix um, showering <laughs> in a slippery environment with lotion, which is slippery. So I don't use these. Uh, here's another thing I don't, well I've started to use these because now I um, take water exercise and I shower at the gym. So this is a shower gel, shower body wash. It smells really good. Kim and I were sniffing it at the post office. It is pear and aloe vera. So that's from Dove, another very common contributor. Um, Tresemme gave us some hairspray. So any age could use that. Nice travel size, keeping your drawer at work. So, and that's everything. That's all, that's everything. I say that that's all because the trendsetter younger box has a lot more stuff in it. Look how full this box is. I'm not gonna say if it's good or bad stuff, but it's a lot fuller. So this is geared towards the younger um, age range, 35 and under. I should have packed this backwards so that the, I just like to go through the paper stuff first. And you notice I'm putting the um, price value for the actual size I've received, received down below as I show it. And at the end, I'll show you what the actual value was compared to the $5 I paid. Um, I'll just go through the inserts. This is from Hello. They do toothpaste. They do have a coupon. Here is, do I have some others? Um, placards, also with a coupon. This is a company I hadn't heard of before, Body Fantasies. Looks like they have like um, body sprays for the most part. So that's just informational. Then let's dive in. We start with the product. So the same Olay sample with the coupon. Here is a different shower lotion. There is, well, there's two. There's the one here to use in the shower, and then this is for after you shower. So just some foil packets, no coupons. Um, this cherry blossom and jojoba oil sounds interesting. Then we got an, another face mask. So I can't tell, this is a sleeping mask. So it's not a sheet mask. It's, um, if any of you have done a sleeping mask, it's basically a like super intense moisturizing lotion that you put on and it absorbs pretty quickly. And then you can wash your face in the morning. So I don't know what donkey, donkey milk is gonna do for me, but um, nourishing and moisturizing. And I've used them before, like these overnight things. And it's not like you get it on, that's not goopy. You don't get it on your pillowcase or anything. At least I don't. Um, maybe if you put a lot on, you would, but I don't have that problem. Um, Shea Moisture, another company frequently pops up in the Walmart boxes. There is a Curl and Shine shampoo and then a Curl and Hansen smoothie. I'm assuming they don't want you to drink it. It is too, um, like a leave-in conditioner. <laughs> Here we have, okay, so this goes with that Hello insert. This is just a little travel size toothpaste. I will use that. Here is, oh, from Body Fantasies. They are, looks like it's kind of a, oh, like two little, two samples. I don't know if it makes a difference or why you're getting two. Oh, one is for 
I don't know, you're supposed to blend them together. Wear alone or blend for a custom scent. Night romance, hearts plus flowers. Whatever, two little perfume samplers and a coupon. <laughs> like, I don't know. I don't think it's probably as concentrated as a um, perfume, so I should just say body spray samplers. Then here's the placards. This is actually very handy because I get the um, bags, you know, the bags, and they have a Ziploc top, you know, zipper or whatever. Uh, and for, I get mine from Dollar Tree because you get a bunch of these for really cheap. But this is nice because it's in a little like travel container. There's 12. So I'm going to stick this into my purse because sometimes I need one while I am in the car or not wherever I have them. <laughs> then a gold bond. Lotion, just your, a nice little, it'll give you a couple couple uses. Hydrating cream, radiance renewal. And the last item we've received this before is the Dove Refresh and Care Dry Shampoo. So there were a lot more items as far as quantity in the trendsetter than the classic box. However, I don't know that either was really geared and nothing that fun, no makeup items this time. Eh. The thing with Walmart, it seems they, and they know you have to, <laughs> you already have to be subscribed. So it's not like they don't know how many they need, but they are very inconsistent as far as whether you're on the early end of receiving your shipment or if you're at the tail end of the shipment, I think you usually get less stuff. It seems they run out, very inconsistent, but they do not advertise that you're going to get a specific amount, that you're gonna get a certain number or anything like that. So, you know, the complaints, you gotta just kinda let it, roll off you because it's five dollars and all they're saying is they're going to send you samples so that's what they do no commitment that you're going to get the same thing that the person next to you may be have ordered so for comparison though this is a target beauty box and i think try, i'm looking at the calendar right now i think this was maybe september let me find out i ordered this a while ago thinking oh i would i actually thought it looked good and it had been marked down and I thought, oh, it'll be perfect then because I'll be getting my Walmart boxes. Well, no. Yeah, because this was the September box. <laughs> so that's how long, you know, and we just received the Walmarts. Um, the difference with the Target Beauty boxes is you will know exactly what you're going to get. They put them up at the beginning of each month. They can range in price from five, rarely five, usually seven to 12, I think, maybe I've seen them up to 15 pretty rare and they will show exactly what you're going to receive they have been I don't know if people are just they used to like sell out all the time so I'm not sure if the demand has actually gone down and people are just not that excited about them anymore or if they like over produced and made too many because usually about by the middle of the month they knock the price down a couple bucks and that's when I got this it was normally seven dollars and I paid five because I'm like oh perfect it comes with an actual little insert telling you all about your products and it gives you a coupon but this coupon will always expire like at the end of the month for three dollars off a fifteen dollar or more purchase these coupons do have promo codes so you can use them online depending on the timing sometimes if you get these every month you can use this towards your next beauty purchase beauty box purchase providing again you have fifteen dollars worth excuse me, I was talking really fast there. Um, and again, these you have to go out and purchase every month. They are, do not have a subscription option available at this time. So here we go. I just realized here's everything. There's something that smells really good in here. This is kind of interesting. Well, it's different. Um, this is Shea Moisture, which I also just received in the Walmart box, but I had a larger sample. But the one for Walmart was curly hair, and this seems to be more, um, well, it's a smooth and tame shampoo and blowout cream. So I guess it could, you know, I think this was still a curly hair themed box, but I don't straighten my hair, so I'll give that to one of my friends that does. Uh, sheet masks were the thing. This is a fun Panda One animals. I love sheet masks in general, any type of face mask, but if they have like a cute little print on the front of an animal or in like sparkly gold, I love them even more. And when I use them, I put them on my Snapchat story. Here's my Snapchat code. Um, if you want to follow me out there, 
it's just, you know, a lot of what this already is. So, you know, if I'm not your cup of tea, don't follow me out there because I'm pretty silly and even more unplugged and than I am here. But <laughs> okay, so I got that. Here was a lotion. Um, these show up in Target, even Walmart, I think. Palmer's um, cocoa butter lotion. The St. Ives Apricot Face Scrub. I remember this from when I was a teenager and it seems to be making the rounds again. You know, everything that was old is new again. So, hey, it's still good. A great exfoliator. This was, was, it is Blueberry Bliss Leave-In Conditioner. I'm excited to try this. Um, I use, use, use leave-in conditioners all the time. Um, I condition very lightly when I'm in the shower and it's usually just on the ends and then I use a leave-in conditioner because I don't wash my hair every day it gets too dry in case you wanted to know that here's another curly curl defining cream moisturizing curl definition less shrinkage for naturals yes that's what it says and it is from curls unleashed or s it's a really nice size. Um, it's got butter and honey. I'm excited. So this is like another leave-in. The only thing I don't like about this, like this is the packaging, because you're not going to probably use all of this product in one time, um, unless you have a really lot of hair. So once you open it, there's not really a way to seal it, whereas like this, <laughs> this has, um, you know, an actual squeeze top so squirt out what you need so maybe I'll use this one up first and then when it's empty I'll wash it out and put this product in there so I don't have a mess and then one last item was from chapstick total hydration blood orange scent and flavor so perfect for this time of year it is winter in Minnesota so that is everything so even without all my super long babble it's still got kind of a long video. So there you go. I just wanted to show you kind of the differences. I think really you're better off doing the Target one <laughs> unless you just have the money that you don't don't mind spending because you know exactly what you want. If you don't like it, you don't have to get it. Um, you get for sure the $3 coupon to use at Target, uh, providing you can use it before it expires. And Walmart, you know, if you enjoy the mystery of not knowing what you're going to get, go for it um it's just at this point hasn't been very consistent so we'll see i'll need to log in and make sure my profile is updated and i'll stick it through to get the winter one and see if they've actually made any changes to try and customize it more towards um those of us that receive it so we'll see anyway thanks for stopping i would love to hear if you are a fan of the target or the walmart beauty boxes and if you got the walmart if you got exactly the same for the fall or if you did get some different stuff it's just interesting i always just like to find out if people get different things and it's just fun to chat and i do like to chat in the comments give me a day or two if you don't see me respond right away but um Hopefully you get the notifications when I respond. Some people are not getting them because they'll ask me questions and I'll respond and then they'll ask me questions again in another video and I'm like, I already answered that, but they're not getting them. So anyway, it's a YouTube glitch. There's glitches there. There's glitches with Walmart. There's glitches everywhere. But hey, you know where there's not a glitch? When it comes to the fact that I know something very important. What do I know? I know that you matter yes there's no glitch in that at all because you do you make a positive difference in this world just by being in it you've made a difference in my life and i am very very grateful that we have connected and that you are here with me today so there you go you're not a glitch don't ever think so i'll see you guys again soon bye